Hello everybody, in this video I'm going to show you how to set up your home studio monitors. Uh, for the purpose of the video I've actually taken down my monitors and my uh, foam isolation pads uh, so that I can show you step by step how to set them up. For the setup I'm going to be using some basic items uh, that hopefully you'll have lying around your house. Um, some post-it notes, a pen, <clears throat> pair of scissors, uh, some tape, uh, a tape measure, a uh, couple of pieces of scrap paper, and some tacks. Okay, let's get started. One important point for the monitors before we mount them uh, is to make sure that the level setting on both speakers is set to the same level. On these, I'm gonna set them to uh, plus four dBU, uh, which is the 12 o'clock position. And I'm gonna do that on, on both sides. Uh, this one also 12 o'clock. So next we're gonna find the center of the speaker. I've already marked these out, did it um, a couple of years ago when I first got the monitors, but we're gonna do it again today using some post-it notes. So I'm going to take two post-it notes. I'm going to place one here at the front and one here at the back. They just need to be in the approximate middle of the speaker. Then I'm going to take the tape measure and I'm going to measure the distance. So this is 21 centimeters. So half of that is 10.5. So let's mark that. 1.5 and then the back is 22 centimeters so halfway is 11 mark that okay we'll just make the <coughs> crosses a little bit bigger okay so we've got one cross here which is the middle at the back and one cross here which is the middle at the front and then later we're going to take two tacks and we're going to put one at that position and another at that position and then we're going to be able to see the same way that you'd line up sights on a gun we can line this pin and this pin together to make sure that we are angling it in the right direction for the rest of this video i'm going to remove the post-it notes and use the yellow dots that i already have on there Okay, so I'm going to use this board to explain the monitor setup. So we've got a left monitor, <clears throat> a right monitor, and our head, and of course our ears. The equilateral triangle setup means that the distance between the left speaker and the head position, the right speaker and the head position and the left speaker and the right speaker are all equal so this length this length and this length are all the same so practically that's a little bit difficult to set up so we are going to use um, the length between this line here and the head position we're going to call that l and on my website there's a calculator so once we understand this length we'll be able to calculate the distance between the two monitors I'll show you how to do that in the next few steps so next we're going to think about the position of the monitor on this shelf so let's mount the foam and the monitor so I think this is going to be the approximate position, uh, something like that. I know that I'm going to be angling a little bit in towards the listening position. And then the monitor, oh, quite heavy. Okay, we're going to put that there. Okay, just for now. So we're going to think about this face. And if we go back to the, the sketch, uh, I want to think about this line and what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my 
max screen to define this line. I'm going to use the max screen and line it up with the front of the monitor. So we're going to try to line up the monitor with this with this line. So I know that I need to move this monitor forward to maybe this position. Let's take a look. So if I look down here, it needs to come forward about one centimeter. Check again. That looks about right. I will set up the other side the same and we'll be back in a moment. The left monitor is set up and I'm just going to check the two uh, distances here. This is five inches, which is the same on the right hand side. And this is just over two and a half inches, which is the same as the right hand side. Okay, so the next step, I'm going to work out my listening uh, position and how far away I am from the monitor that I've just set up. So I'm going to take a seat and <clears throat> my listening position is basically um, here. Next, I'm going to figure out how far away my ear is from the monitor to my ear. Okay, that's exactly 112 centimeters. One, one, two centimeters. And we're going to use 112 centimeters on the calculator to calculate the distance between the left and right hand monitor. So let's go and do that on the online calculator right now. On my website, uh, there is a guide to uh, the home studio monitor setup and there's a calculator um, a little bit down the page. Okay. So what we're gonna do, we've, take, we've got 112 centimeters as the, the measurement to my ear. Let's type that in, 112 press calculate and that gives us a result of 129.3 centimeters 129.33 centimeters okay so let's take the two measurements that we've got so the distance from the uh, the the Mac monitor to my ear was 112 centimeters and the calculation that we got from the online calculator um, means that this distance between the left and right hand monitor should be 129 centimeters. So let's check what the actual dimension is right now and then we'll adjust it to 129 centimeters if it's not right. It's probably not right. So let's find 129 centimeters. There it is and the distance between there and there, no. So it's about five centimeters off. So I need to bring both of these monitors in about two and a half centimeters. So we move this in about two and a half centimeters and we'll move this one in about two and a half centimeters. Check again. Remember we're looking for 129. Okay, we're still four centimeters out, so we need to move that over about two centimeters. This one over about two centimeters. This is starting to overhang now, so actually I don't want to move it in any further than that. So hopefully we're close to 129. It's actually uh, 130.5 centimeters, so I think it's close enough. The last step of this process, we're gonna take two pins, 
place them on the marks that we made earlier on top of the monitors. I'm going to put one here, one here. Make sure they're in the correct positions. And now I'm going to take a seat and I'm going to make sure that these two pins are lining up with my ear. So if I sit in my right. So you can see now that those two pins are not lined up. So now I've set the camera position to where my head is looking at the speakers and you can see that the, the pin at the back doesn't line up with the pin at the front. So I need to move this forward a little bit, keep the plane, the front of the speaker in the same position. So let's just angle it a little bit in I need to look at the camera view. Okay, we need to move it in just a little bit more. One more. I think that's close enough. The next is to repeat that on this side. I repeat the same process and we're done. So there we have it. Everything's set up nicely. The monitors are the right distance apart and they're pointing in towards the listening spot. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and see you again next time.